I mean, wet the f Excuse me. Let's just pin that one in. Ow! Sweet. All right, what's up, YouTube? I'm back for another video. I thought I would fill you guys in on my nighttime routine. As a lot of you know, I live alone in Sydney at the moment. So this is kind of what I get up to on a regular night with Ali. Not all of it, though, because I'm only showing you what I do with my face when it comes to beauty routines and such. So my nighttime routine... This is it. First of all, it obviously starts with some good music. I'm the kind of person that always needs to be playing music in your house, whether it's... I don't know. As soon as I wake up, I put music on the speakers. When I'm getting ready for bed, I put music on the speakers. This is something that I do at night time. I kind of like to just listen to something a little bit mellow. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I'll save that kind of music for another day or on a night that I'm actually going out. I'm being a grandma on this Sunday night and... Probably gonna go to bed by 8.30 And that is why I'm gonna listen to some nice, probably jazz music instead Usually I like to make myself a nice like green tea or something before bed to really relax me But for some reason tonight I felt like treating myself But I should probably shut up right now and get into my nighttime routine and show you guys that Step number one is my holy grail face cleanser. Now that I do have some makeup on from my work today, I am going to take it off using this cleanser. It is the best. I'll wet my hands a little bit and just simply cleanse. Now, as you guys can see, I'm actually wearing some false eyelashes at the moment, little individuals on the end. But my tip for anyone that's busy and works a lot or just simply wants to make their next day makeup routine easier, keep them on and honestly just scrub around your eyes. Then I'll grab one of these cheeky guys, wet it up with warm water. That is totally happening. And just gently go around those eyelashes. Okay, now that my face is very clean, you can see how light that cleanser is and it really takes off all of your makeup and makes your skin really smooth and shiny. Now, the next thing I'm gonna do is this Kiehl's Microdermabrasion Scrub. See, this is something that's quite heavy and I'll only do this once or twice a week. So I'm gonna do this tonight because I haven't done it this week and show you guys what it does. It really makes a difference, like not just this scrub, but any kind of scrub that has little, you know, micro beads in it or anything like that is really good for your skin when it comes to really like getting deep into those pores because a gel cleanser is always gonna take off your makeup but if you really want to get deep down into your pores to prevent breakouts, then I really recommend a good scrub. I've used this one to absolute death as to why I'm finding it hard to get more than that out. Okay, there we go. You'll need a really, really small bit. It's actually a lot better to start scrubbing on a somewhat dry face. So I've honestly just put the smallest drop of water onto this so it stays kind of rough and really gets in there. And you just sort of slowly massage that into your pores. My face is probably going to go a bit red after this. Now I'm going to make the water warm and splash it off. Just like all those Neutrogena commercials, but not so glamorous. It really makes a difference to your skin. And anytime I do this, I wake up in the morning and I actually notice a difference in my skin. It's sort of glowing. Ignore the few pimples I have. I ate pizza on the weekend and I am currently being punished for it. Love it. Now I know there are so many different kinds of these eye masks and face masks. These ones I swear by, they are by Skin Republic and they are amazing. So I like to do this, I mean I don't do it every night because it's a little bit more extra, but I like to do it a couple times a week. It takes away any tired bags that you have. Um, brightness, boosting, retinol helps brighten dark circles. Just said that. Okay, now that these have been on for 15 minutes, I'm going to take them off. So this is fresh after the scrub, so everything feels very clean. All right, I'm sure this product isn't new to you guys, and I'm sure you've seen a lot of your favorites use it. This is definitely one of my favorite products. It's Myra Badasco Skincare and facial spray with aloe, herbs, and rose water. So it just smells like rose water. The best thing about this is the price. It is literally $7. You'll see it around. It's a great brand. It's very, very affordable, but at the same time, very, very good. It really makes your face feel fresh and cool again after I've just attacked it. So I don't know if you guys can see a little bit how that scrub has really opened up my pores and made my skin 
look very, very clean. And now this is one of my favorite products of my nighttime routine, which is a very new one for me. This product is IT Cosmetics Confidence in a Cream Transforming Moisturizing Super Cream. So that wraps up my nighttime routine. That is pretty much everything I do before I go to bed if I'm really wanting my skin to look great and do the whole proper routine. And usually I'm pretty slack, but I decided to do it tonight for the vlog and my skin feels amazing right now. So I think <laughs> it's like a self-realization that I'm gonna be doing this more. As you guys can see, my skin is looking, it's almost like I've got highlighter on. I love you guys. Thanks again for watching and good night and sweet dreams.